27, 2000, seven-year-old Robbie Romero was last seen leaving a friend's house. No one ever saw him again. Investigators don't know where he went or if he's still alive. Fifteen years later, Robbie's case is still unsolved. Santa Fe police have no new leads. There's no evidence now that either he's still alive or new information that he's somewhere else. But they are not giving up. The police department says this is one of the most difficult cases they have ever dealt with, especially because their prime suspect is dead. Just a few years after Robbie vanished, his older brother Ronnie was arrested on unrelated charges. He told police he knew where his brother's body was and he'd reveal the location if the charges against him were dropped. But that deal never went through, and Ronnie later died of an overdose. It is very frustrating. When he did pass away in 2009, um, that information just died at that point also. Ronnie also told police his girlfriend was involved, but that was a dead end too. And now... No idea where her whereabouts are. The last time investigators thought they had a break, a teen contacted them and said he was Robbie Romero. But DNA tests proved he wasn't. Today, there is one detective assigned to Robbie's case waiting for any new information. We have not given up. It's still an active and open investigation. The department is asking anyone who knows anything to come forward to bring closure for Robbie, his family, and the entire city. In Santa Fe, Lead Ali Kani, KOAT Action 7 News.